أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم From Karbala to Sham Ashura Grief Bloodshed Trampled bodies <laughs> There was nothing to comfort the children not even a cool breeze. Mm. Hussein's bones have been crushed. On the dry ground his body lies. The coffins have broken their promise. From the heavens Fatima cries. Mm. After trampling on Hussein's chest, the tyrants rushed towards his tents. But do not be afraid. Zainab is in control of the event. Mm. The sky is red. The tents are set alight. The Yatim are lamenting. They are deprived of their right. The land shook with anger when Ali Yassin's dignity was robbed. Mm. When the angels saw how the enemy was vicious, they all screamed and sobbed. In the middle of chaos, Lady Zainab stood facing the Qibla, praying Salat al-Layl, showing her devotion to al fatah The captives had chains on their hands, neck and feet. Their bodies were so tired that they tilted in the feet. Hmm. Baba, come back to me, Baba. This is what Ruqayya sighed. Then she was beaten without any respite. In her pain, she cried. Do you think the misfortunes of the Ahlul Bayt are all done? Mm. Then let me tell you that the journey of tears has only just begun. Zainab whispered, Oh Baba, we are now entering the city of Kufa that she once did rule. But its leader has changed and its people are now cruel. Under the stare of hypocrites, the pure family was led to Amnesiad's palace hall. Like her mother at Fedek, Lady Um Kulthum stood proud and tall. Woe unto you, she called out to the coffins in a voice they couldn't ignore. She made the people cry like they never did before. The tale of sorrow I will continue to recite. From city to city, the holy faces were exposed in the daylight. Unexpected was what they saw in Sham. A Sham, a Sham, a Sham. The city looked so joyful that the travelers started to wonder. Was it a day of Eid mm. for there to be so much color? Mm. The heads on the spears were paraded <laughs> until Yazid's fortress. At their arrival, Yazid laughed at Ali Muhammad's distress. Allah. Oh, son of a freed slave, mm. Zainab suddenly called out. Silence rose as everybody tried to analyze the shout. Imam Zainul Abidin then presented himself like never before. 
everybody was listening, including the Earth's core. Mm. He said, I am the grandson of Mecca and Mina. I am the grandson of Zamzam and Safa. I am the grandson of the one who fought at Badr and Hunay. Mm. I am Ali, son of Hussein. Yazid wasn't like before. He had gone all pale. His first order after he recovered was send them to jail. In the night, Rukaya wouldn't go to bed. Mm. The evil Yazid commanded to give her Hussein's head. Mm. As Hussein's daughter discovered what was under the bowl, Israel appeared out of nowhere and freed the innocent girl's soul. Yazid was so afraid that he let Hussein's beloved go. They first returned to Karbala to let their tears flow. This lady's sacrifice shouldn't be in vain. It's our duty to keep alive the legacy of Hussein. Wake up, Shaf Ali. Majalis al Hussein needs your support. Our mosques are left empty. What will you say in the last court? Mm. Let's pledge allegiance as if we were standing in Bainul Haramain. Mm. La Baik, La Baik, La Baik, Ya Hussein! La Baik, La Baik, La Baik, Ya Hussein! Salli ala Muhammad wa ala Muhammad! The Zahra Trust, changing millions of lives every year.